Probability is a measurement or description of how likely an event is to happen. We can give probability using numbers or using words. The terms that we use to describe the likelihood of an event are impossible, very unlikely, unlikely, even chance, likely, very likely, and certain. When the probability of an event is even chance, this means that it is as likely to happen as it is not to happen. For example, if Theo's puppy steals his shoes, there is an even chance that it will be the left shoe. Using numbers to measure probability. When an event is certain to happen, we say that its probability is 1. For example, the probability of rolling a number greater than 0 on a dice is 1. An event with an even chance is exactly as likely to happen as it is not to happen, so its probability is 1 over 2. When an event is impossible, we say that its probability is zero. For example, the probability of a dice landing on the ceiling when it is dropped is zero. How to calculate probability. Probability is essentially the likelihood of a particular event occurring. We can work out numerical probabilities other than 0, 1 over 2, or 1 by looking at possible outcomes. To calculate probability, you need to know two factors, the potential number of desired outcomes and the total number of outcomes. Once you know these two factors, you can calculate the probability of a specific outcome using this formula. Probability equals potential number of desired outcomes over the total number of outcomes. For example, we could describe the probability of getting a 3 when we roll dice as unlikely. But to give it a numerical value, we need to think about how many possible outcomes there are. When we roll dice, there are six outcomes. One, two, three, four, five, or six. And only one of these outcomes is a three thrown. So we say that the probability of throwing a three is one over six. Let's try it ourselves. Alana writes each letter of her first name on a card shuffles the card, then takes the top card. What is the probability that the card she takes has a letter A on it? 3 over 5 Because three of the letters in her name are A's, and there are five letters altogether in her name, that makes it 3 over 5. Decimals and percentages Probability can be shown in many ways. In science and mathematics, probability is more specific and can be represented as a ratio, fraction, decimal, or percentage. A ratio may look like 1 to 6, meaning that for every 6 times a die is rolled, one of these 6 times, the side with 3 dots will face up. The same results can be represented in a fraction decimal, or percentage. The fraction can be attained by changing the ratio to 1 over 6. To get the decimal, we do the calculation that the fraction requires. For example, 1 divided by 6 gives us 0 0.16. In order to get the percentage, all we need to do is multiply this decimal by 100, and we get 16% which tells us that 16% of the time when we throw a die, the side with three dots will face up. 
Whether you're flipping a coin, rolling a die, or picking a marble, knowing the basics of probability helps you predict outcomes and make informed decisions. For more information and resources related to probability, head to twinkle.com.